Right, and that is President Dr. William Ruto indicating the Kenya Kwanza intervention as far as the cost of living is concerned. Let me start with uh, Mr. Bilo Kero. Inflation is trending at a high we haven't seen in 63 months as we speak. And the Kenya Kwanza government is telling us our intervention, our understanding is that we're dealing with a, dem a production problem. We have been trying to subsidize consumption. We think we should be subsidizing production. And hence the fertilizer discussion which uh, the president brought in. What are your thoughts on this? Do you think it will uh, move the needle? Not in the short term. Um, you know, fertilizer, you would expect the harvest sometime around March. Um, and, and, and the issue of um, the cost of food, for example, is, is, is a crisis today. If there is no subsidy in the next few days and weeks, for example, on food, uh, on fuel, you know, on, 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 on all these things, you, you, you have a situation where uh, Kenyans would, would probably, uh, they will not be on the streets, they would be very disappointed because one of the pledges they made is that the price of Unga will be down to 100 shillings. Um, they made pledges that the fuel prices will be down to 70 or something. Um, they, 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 you know, it's, it's all based on the pledges that they have made. So I, I think uh, the cost of production, yes, one of the, one of the factors is, is, is fertilizers and the inputs of raw materials uh, in many industries. Um, but it's not going to be the only solution. It's not going to be enough. I mean, there are many other factors. Um, you know, that, that, that for example, I, I, I'll give you an example of um, uh, edible oils for, for cooking oil. Um, is imported, uh, raw material. Um, so the only thing that you can address is probably on the taxes, uh, the duty and the VAT and those things. Uh, so I, I don't think the actions that he has mentioned with regards to, I think he's cut it around the issue really. He didn't, I thought he would go further into, for example, tomorrow the review of the uh, energy prices. Yeah. Fuel prices will be 14th tomorrow. So I would have expected him to say, okay, tomorrow the prices are going to remain um, uh, the current <laughs> prices because we'll continue with the subsidy. Yeah. Interestingly, the president intimated that he is doing away with the fuel subsidy. And Mike, uh, if you could play the second clip on uh, President William Ruto on the 